My name is Snuggle Nugget, and here is my story. I had a bad couple of weeks recently. When I look back, I am lucky to be here. It makes me tired just thinking about it. It was a nail biter. But before that, I want to look back to when I was born. Here is my newborn picture with my brothers and sisters. We snuggled together all the time. And we also had some great human kids looking after us. But there was one kid that was special to me. His name was Brendan. He came over every day after school to look after me and make sure I was doing okay. Oh, I just loved him. And then I was able to go home with him finally. And that was wonderful. And I was told I was going to have some new friends there. And then I met them. First day I was there, I met Storm. He was a big dog, but he was afraid of me. It was funny. Then I met Haley. She just kind of stayed away from me and barked at me. I didn't pay her any mind. Then I saw Rainy. We were best buds right away. We would play and have a great time. Then the oldest dog of the bunch, Rocky. The way he looked at me, I thought he was afraid of me. And then I would sleep. And then the next thing you would know, I would see him looking at me. And I think he's smiling at me. But I think he was just playing it cool. But I think he'll like me too. There were times that I would help my human mom when she was trying to do some work. And then I worked so hard I'd have to take a nap again. And then one day everything changed. I don't even remember what happened. But all of a sudden, I was at the vet hospital not feeling too well. I was told my human mom saved my life. And thanks to her and to all the vet and the people at the clinic, I got better really quick. They were happy I was able to get better so fast and go home. And my human, Brendan, was so happy to get me back. But I had to stay in a kennel. I had restrictions. I did not like that at all. But on the good side, Storm kept a watch over me every night when I was in the kennel to make sure I was doing okay. But I got wise. I knew that when I saw the vet next, I had to act like any other kitten, playful, and bouncing around, and happy. And the doctor saw me and said, wow, she's doing so good, you don't have to keep her in the kennel anymore. I was so happy, and now I get to lay in the big bed with my new buddies, and I am happy and healthy again. And I want to... Thank everybody who prayed for me, and a special thanks to Sarah and Sam, Tamar and Charlene, 